Market. I am Eve Nyaga and right about now we want to talk about matters of the hair. Dreadlocks in particular. And in studio I have three specialists. Specialists. I mean it's we are talking serious matters about the dreadlocks. You know it's been a culture that's been on the rise and we need to know about the trends that are going on, hair color and about an event that they had yesterday. So I want my guests to introduce themselves and I will start with the gentleman next to me. Hi, I'm Pasco Kusekwa, all the way from Tanzania. Mm -hmm. Welcome to Kenya. Okay, thank you. Thank you. I'm Uwe Joe from Uganda, mm. Kampala. Thank you so yeah. much. I'm Leticia Mugele from Kenya. All right. Thank you so much for making time to join us. So um, um, kindly tell us what you specialize in and all the things that you do. Okay, we specialize in dreadlocks and dreadlocks extensions, mm -hmm. and uh, we do all kind of hair, yeah. all type of hair, mm -hmm. and everything about dreadlocks. Yeah. We do sister locks, okay. micro locks, and other locks. All right, yeah. thank you. Um, me I specialize in dreadlocks, natural hair, mm -hmm. and makeup. Mm -hmm. Yeah, okay, mainly. Thank yeah. you. Yeah. Leticia? I also do dreadlocks. Mm -hmm. I do. I braid, mm -hmm. I do weights, mm -hmm. yeah. Thank you so much. So tell us maybe some of the trends that you have seen on the rise concerning dreadlocks. Some of the rise is extension. Mm -hmm. People are doing extension on their dreadlocks. Yeah. And also styling. Mm -hmm. People are doing so well in styling, mm -hmm. yeah. Mm -hmm. What are some of the major styles that you've seen? Okay, with dreadlocks, mm -hmm. Uh, I wouldn't say that what are the major styles, mm -hmm. but you can do avant-garde, you can mm -hmm. do just something extraordinary. Mm -hmm. Or maybe yeah. like something like what you have on your yeah, hair. Yeah, right like now. something I have on my hair. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay. <laughs> Please tell us about extensions and what are the new new extensions that you are having, what are people doing to their dreadlocks? Right you might now. find someone who has dreadlocks. Today I have my natural hair, yeah. but tomorrow I have dreadlocks. Yeah. How? Uh, right now, mm -hmm. actually, things have changed. You can actually uh, do, like, we, we extend hair mm -hmm. from a side, mm -hmm. and, then, and then when you come, mm -hmm. for example, you're a client, you just come and we put those extensions. And uh, right now, extensions, are we, we, we have artificials, we do artificial extensions with with synthetic, mm -hmm. and then we also do natural extensions. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. So all, all you need is your hair. Like mm -hmm. you come, like for example, you mm -hmm. today they can see with a weave. Tomorrow mm -hmm. they can see Have with a long red locks. <laughs> but mine are natural. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and the rest yeah. natural. Uh, mine is extension. Uh -huh. Okay. Yeah. Mm -hmm. um, I want you to talk about color and red locks. Yeah. And yes, so color and dreadlocks. Okay. The the major colors that you're seeing. Yeah, what are the new trends in terms of styling? I mean, coloring that dreadlocks. Okay, color. Mm -hmm. It's become dark. Uh, nowadays, everybody wants color. If yeah. you have, you put dreadlocks and mm -hmm. color, mm -hmm. it should look a little amazing. Yeah. So now I've seen different colors. For instance, now we have extensions and mm -hmm. we make them in different colors. People yeah. can that can fix uh -huh. for a short time that mm -hmm. they want. Yeah. You can put in color you want mm -hmm. and you can change the color. Mm -hmm. Yeah. However you want. Yeah. Yes. You want and we have temporary color nowadays. Mm -hmm. So you can put it wherever you want the color and then mm -hmm. once you you are tied with it you can wash it. Mm -hmm. oh. And um is it the same trend in Uganda? You're from Uganda, right? No, I'm from Tanzania. Yeah Tanzania, yes, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> is it the same for Tanzania, trend? Mm -hmm. For Tanzania now things that's trending is dreadlocks mm -hmm. extensions. Yeah. As me, I'm dealing much with dreadlocks extensions, mm -hmm. and I make 100% mm -hmm. human hair mm -hmm. extensions okay. and synthetic. Uh -huh. Like mine uh -huh. are 100% human hair extensions, yeah. and they look real. Uh -huh. uh, it's looking more real. Yeah. Like everybody can say, that's uh -huh. your hair. Yes. And people now mm -hmm. are moving too fast to dreadlocks mm -hmm. and natural hair. Yeah. So you can see some more people are coming in natural mm -hmm. and dreads mm -hmm. and they want extensions mm -hmm. and the, the, the the thing that you have improved now mm -hmm. is uh the some of people want dreadlocks for the extra time yeah for instance you want dreadlocks now mm -hmm. and you want to remove them t tomorrow. tomorrow yeah, yeah. so mm -hmm. then that's very good yeah and uh, I, al I always did the hair for the stars who want the 
temporary, mm -hmm. like Diamond, like mm -hmm. other stylists okay. who want uh, who want them temporary. Yeah. We took them off. Then mm -hmm. we put another style. We changed the style. Mm -hmm. So dreadlocks now is trending in Tanzania, and mm -hmm. so many people want extensions because mm -hmm. it's extension mm -hmm. temporary. Yeah. yeah. So um, this the event that you were the judges yesterday, um, natural. Dreadlocks affair, sorry. And um, I would like you to talk to us about the event. Yes, Iruro. Uh, the, the event was marvelous. Mm -hmm. uh, I like our opinions are taking this to another level. Mm -hmm. These guys have put in a lot. Because it's it's not all about you know making money, mm -hmm. but also giving out to the people, yeah. to the to the new stylists mm -hmm. are, which are coming in. Mm -hmm. So it's like a support. Yeah. They're trying to support that the new generation which is coming, you know. Mm -hmm. And and I liked everything. I, I copied the idea mm -hmm. in Uganda. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to talk into Uganda because uh -huh. it's 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 more of the support and giving out, yeah. you know. Yes, awarding someone because mm -hmm. you can, for example, you you can be like you know working here mm -hmm. and you're not recognized. Yeah. But these people are trying to recognize people's talents. It's true. Yeah. 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 Thank I you. liked it everything. Uh -huh. yeah. So Leticia, tell us some of the activities that were taking place yesterday. Oh, we were dealing with. Mm -hmm. There was natural hair, mm -hmm. there was color. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so the, the whole thing was amazing. Mm -hmm. You see how people are getting to know what they are supposed to do. They are learning so much. Yeah. And it's so good for the people who are organizing such things because mm -hmm. they are making the, the young artists who are not known yeah. like us mm -hmm. when I started, mm -hmm. maybe no one knew mm -hmm. Leticia, yeah. but right now most of the people know me, mm -hmm. yeah, though they call me happy, many of them. <laughs> <laughs> so it's, it's a good thing mm -hmm. because it makes us explore, yeah. it makes it unite us, mm -hmm. so, and it's very good for us to have such things. Thank yeah. you so much for the organizers. Yeah, and the networking too. Yeah, the networking too. And mm -hmm. we get to know each other. Mm -hmm. Like maybe you never knew who Farouk is. Mm -hmm. I never knew who Farouk yeah. is until I Yesterday. went to Afro Hair uh -huh. and I saw Farouk. And yeah. I'm like, hi, you're so happy to see someone like that. Because yeah. he's a hair guru. Mm -hmm. Yeah, which is amazing. Mm -hmm. You get to ask him, you get to interact to him one on one. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And that's a good thing. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Um, Pascal, mm -hmm. tell us what stood out for you yesterday, being a judge during the event. What stood out for you about the stylist? Uh, the stylist, mm -hmm. they was doing good. Yeah. And uh, I learned so many things mm -hmm. from the event. Mm -hmm. And. Uh, I even like mm -hmm. sharing ideas from them. I see some monsters that was really amazing. Yeah. And uh, I think uh, I should try to apply this in Tanzania because <laughs> there's no event like this. Yeah, everybody's I was really inspired to meet some different people. Yeah. And uh, they are taking far the industry. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Now we are going to the next level. Mm -hmm. And uh, I think that's a good thing, sharing mm -hmm. an ideas. Because I came all the way from Tanzania mm -hmm. and he, yeah. I'm in Kenya now, yeah. and uh, I think uh, I have got something that I can go and explain. implement. Yeah. 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 Okay. Nice. So, Leticia, I'm um, having um, extensions of dreadlocks. How would someone take care of that? The extension. Yeah. When they are when they are dirty, mm -hmm. you can come back to the salon. Mm -hmm. They wash for you. They treat it. Mm -hmm. Because they'll be treating your hair. Yeah, that's true. Even if you have the extension. Yeah. Then they moisturize, mm -hmm. they rinse, they moisturize, mm -hmm. and then they style you. Mm -hmm. It Just will that. be as easy as that. Yeah. yeah. So how often should you do that? Maybe twice or thrice uh -huh. a week. Uh -huh or maybe once a month. Yeah. So it depends with you uh -huh. as well. <laughs> you and your pockets. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, what about you, Iruro? Yeah. Taking care of natural dreadlocks. Natural what does dreadlocks? that consist of? Yeah. OK, natural dreadlocks, mm -hmm. it's more of your, like, your hair. Mm -hmm. uh, the only difference is like you've rolled it. Yeah. So it's, it's the same way we, 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 we take care of our hair. The only difference is mm -hmm. we need to you know, repair it. Mm -hmm. For example, when it has grown down, the growth, mm -hmm. you need to relocate. Yeah. Like to roll it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but then 
what else we need to do oiling mm -hmm. moisturize it mm -hmm. so that it can look good yeah. so natural dreadlocks are mm -hmm. easy to take care of yeah yeah <laughs> are you saying that the extensions are, are hard no, no, to no, take no. care all of all dreadlocks you know <laughs> fall in the same category <laughs> right now we're talking about dreadlocks yes. so uh, they fall in the same category uh -huh. yeah it's just easy to maintain no you know, when you, for example, people work, for mm -hmm. example, you, you're busy, yeah. you know, you don't need to go do weaves and then remove it mm -hmm. more. Yeah. For example, like me, mm -hmm. I'm, I'm a busy man, mm -hmm. I do music, I do hair. Yeah. So the only thing we can sustain is dreadlocks because mm -hmm. they don't give me a time to, to maintain. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Nice. And what about you? How much, for example, your look, I can see it looks very natural. If I wanted the same look, Give me a price range of what I would need to have so that I can yeah. have such a look. Okay. If you want the same look, like uh -huh. uh, my extensions here, because mm -hmm. this is 100% human and it needs yeah. 8 inches. Uh -huh. And now, uh, uh, <laughs> I would explain it in 10 inches because I don't know. <laughs> yeah, it's okay. It's almost 400 uh -huh. Tanzanian shillings. 400 Tanzanian yeah. shillings. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. But where Sabu? Please do the math for us. <laughs> <laughs> yes, but I'm sure it's not as expensive as we would think. It's not It's expensive. something, something um, that you can manage. Yeah. yeah, because you can stay with the hair for a long time mm -hmm. and you can remove mm -hmm. and you put, and them put it back. You don't need you to buy the hair again. You don't need to buy the hair again. Yeah. It's permanent. Mm -hmm. if, uh, whether you want to change their size mm -hmm. and length, mm -hmm. you can buy another extension. But if you want the same look, mm -hmm. you can just use, use the, the, same. the old extensions. Yeah. Leticia, yes. since you're from Kenya, give us a price range of to have something maybe like what you have on right now? To have something like what I have, mm -hmm. it's around 10,000. Mm -hmm. 10,000 yeah. shillings. Yeah. Okay, right. Yeah, it's a bit deep, but I can see that sh she looks amazing, we have to say, right? <laughs> you can do a hair flip so that they can see. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> so what is it that we expect in the next few years in terms of dreadlocks? Where do you see this industry going? Because I can see that so many artists have grown in the industry and people are making waves out here as stylists. Let me start with you. Oh, in the next generation, mm -hmm. I think more people will embrace having natural hair, mm -hmm. dreadlocks, that is. Because yeah. right now it's like maybe 60%. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you'd walk and turn and see like, oh my God, everyone has dreadlocks. Yeah. Yeah, so being, uh, us having the um, organization like mm -hmm. maybe Afro Hair, mm -hmm. Dreadlocks Affair, yeah. and many others which are coming up, mm -hmm. I think in the next maybe five, four, we'll have amazing things. Even the people outside mm -hmm. Kenya or outside this country mm -hmm. will start doing even to the white people. Yeah, yeah. yeah because most of them, uh -huh. they also they started that. doing dreadlocks. Yeah. Yeah, so uh -huh. I think we'll have a lot yes. more things. All right, thank yeah. you. Hiruro? Uh, me, I would look at it as um, an African, because mm -hmm. uh, God had the reason why he gave us this kind of hair, yeah. curly hair. Yeah. So um, it's more of like, uh, uh, let me talk it like in, take it in the way of money, mm -hmm. money ways. It's, it's, it serves money, because mm -hmm. uh, I'm using my own hair. Mm -hmm. uh, if I do it, like I will not remove, even if I remove it, it will remain my hair. It's not like when you, you buy, for example, I'm not offending someone here. Mm -hmm. <laughs> for example, when you buy a weave yeah. and then uh, the uh -huh. next day you Is remove it. it. Mm -hmm. No, I didn't see it. <laughs> <laughs> you buy me? a weave and then um, the next day mm -hmm. you remove it. Yeah. And, uh, that's why me, I say that's why Africans, we're still crying poverty. Mm -hmm. um, we, we, we God gave us a gift mm -hmm. to, to, you know, gave us this hair. Why don't we use it? Yeah. So I'm saying like the next next 10 years or 20 years to come, mm -hmm. Africans are going to come back to their roots yeah. and, and adopt their way of living. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. What about you, Pascal? Where do For you me, see the I think, in the next few years? I think Sorry. the industry is going far. Mm -hmm. I can see it in the next four years. Like now, everybody mm -hmm. likes dreadlocks. It's Did true. you like dreadlocks? Yeah, I actually you had like I have dreadlocks. Yeah. So I see everybody will have dreadlocks. Mm -hmm. Especially now, we have extensions. Mm -hmm. Now people want to put extensions and grow their natural hair. Yeah. So I can say that 
And uh, next five years, mm -hmm. will all people have dreadlocks. Yeah. And also, everybody. Yeah, everybody. <laughs> because women now are busy, uh -huh. are busy working. Yeah. yeah. They don't have time to go to Sarun every day. Yes. So now the only thing that they can save the time mm -hmm. is dreadlocks. Is dreadlocks. Yeah. Because you can have dreadlocks and put just oil mm -hmm. and you go. Yeah. Okay. You can have dreadlocks mm -hmm. and make, there's different kind of dreadlocks, you know, there's free from locks. Yes. You cannot even twist, you just put some oils, mm -hmm. you go to salon to maintain the dreadlocks once per month mm -hmm. or twice per month. Yeah. So if it's one per month, uh -huh. it saves money. So yeah, it saves money. So then you, you save time, mm -hmm. you save money. So people now are going back to natural yeah. and uh, I think in the way how mm -hmm. we are supposed to be yeah. as an African. Yes. Yeah. All right. So kindly tell us your social media pages and where people can find you and anything else that you have to add on. Okay. Actually, I have two pages mm -hmm. on Instagram. Mm -hmm. uh, the first, I use dreadlocks underscore specialist. Mm -hmm. And the second is dreadlocks underscore Tanzania. Mm -hmm. Yeah. All right. That's thank you so page. much. Okay. Thank What's you. about you? Uh, mine, uh, they can go on Facebook and Instagram. It's Iruro Hair and Style Studio. Mm -hmm. Yes. Kindly like spell Iruro. I R I U R O mm -hmm. Hair and Style Studio. Mm -hmm. And like also a musician. Yeah, Tell us where they can find your music. My music is everywhere YouTube, mm -hmm. uh, Howie Music. Actually, I'm a washpa. Mm -hmm. Like, I do gospel wash yeah. music. Yeah. I know you're surprised. <laughs> I am. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I do watch music. Uh -huh. uh, they can find it on YouTube. Though in music, mm -hmm. I use iJuro mm -hmm. Ministries. Yeah. It's I mm -hmm. J U R O Ministries mm -hmm. music. Yes. Okay. They can find it, download it. It's amazing. Yes. Yeah. Thank you. What about you, Leticia? On my Facebook page, it's Happy Rock the Locks because so many people call me happy. Mm -hmm. On my Instagram, is Dreadlocks. The specialist, mm -hmm. yeah, and I'm so happy because I've met the likes of a Tanzanian, <laughs> yeah. a Ugandan, yes, and I'm so happy for that. Mm -hmm. And what I can add on is, you don't have to be great to get started. Mm -hmm. You can get started mm -hmm. to be great. Yeah, that's yeah. interesting. Thank you. <laughs> so thank you so much, guys, for making time to join us and talk to us about dreadlocks. Yes, and we wish you all the best in your careers as Thank dreadlock you. stylist. Yes, and that is what we had for you about dreadlocks. And it seems like everyone is going to the dreadlocks. I think I'll also ditch my wigs Please in my do. ways. <laughs> I'll think about it. Yes. So